So Donald Trump and some of his associates, uh, sure. you know, did not like the result of the election in Georgia. I, I think that people found it implausible that an Alzheimer's patient that can barely form a sentence is getting the most votes. Sorry, in a, a what? An Alzheimer's patient, Joe Biden, who can barely form a sentence. What, is, what are you uh, saying? I'm saying that Joe Biden is cognitively in decline, and that's fairly obvious. No gun-free zones. Wait, so, m more guns. Yep. Can't fight fire with water. You gotta fight fire with fire. This was the moment it all went south. You can't fight fire with water? Yeah. Depends on what's in the fire. They specifically do fight fire with water. Yeah. I wish I could say I was surprised, but... We won with poorly educated. I love the poorly educated. He said it. Their own leader said it to their faces. So Donald Trump and some of his associates, uh, you know, did not like the result of the election in Georgia. I, I think that people found it implausible that an Alzheimer's patient that can barely form a sentence is getting the most votes. Sorry, in a, a what? An Alzheimer's patient, Joe Biden, who can barely form a sentence. What, is, what are you uh, saying? I'm saying that Joe Biden is cognitively in decline. Stunning stupidity, but... It's a trend. Tell me about um, if if Donald Trump does not win, what do you what do you do? I hope that I'm going to die. <laughs> she might laugh, but this interview was with our own David Schuster, and it simply went off the rails, pointing to how a harmless joke may not be laughable after all. Well, for one, you're talking to someone there that was there on January 6. He didn't try to overthrow the election. Okay, what he tried to do was the legal way. Mm, try again. I just think unions protect people who don't really want to work hard. An insane line of thinking. Is it about Donald Trump that you like? Everything. Everything. We need Donald Trump. He probably is the only thing that's going to stop us from World War III. You know, I mean, he won the last election. He got cheated. We all got cheated. You know, not only is he for America, but he can save the world. Not just America. What will you do if Donald Trump loses in 2024? Time to pack up and move to the mountains. <laughs> she won't do it. If Donald Trump is convicted in any of these cases, yes. would that change your mind about voting for him? It would not. Not at all. It'd make me want to vote for him more. What would it say about the justice system if he's convicted? The justice system is a joke. If you haven't looked at any real law cases, the justice system is a joke. Perfect example, Hillary Clinton. She should have been in jail a long time ago. Bill Clinton should have been in jail a long time ago. Joe Biden should have been in jail a long time ago. But if the justice system is a joke, how could we trust even, say, a conviction of Joe Biden? Because you, you can't trust anything anymore. I mean, you just answered your own question. What will you do if Joe Biden wins and Donald Trump loses? Uh, me? I'm already getting ready for what I'm going to do. You said you're getting ready. What? Getting ready for what? Getting ready for the collapse. So what will you do? I mean, what does a collapse look like? Uh, your economy is gone. Your money, you're going to look like Venezuela. That's simple. This guy is just a walking right-wing talking point. Makes me feel for him, honestly. What will Donald Trump do to save America in a second term? Close the border. Close the border and get all these illegals that came in through the border, not illegally, out of this country and bring oil back. What is it about the illegals that's so problematic? They come in not wanting the American dream. Like years ago, the illegals came in for the American dream. They came here to work and make a better life for them and their family. But I thought that's what they're crossing now. They all say, you know, we're escaping violence in Ecuador and Honduras and all these sort of places. To me, they're coming in to ruin this country. We're going to get attacked in the middle of this country because of some of the illegals that we can't vent are coming in, and that's their way in to get us. That's my feeling. So you think some of the illegals are here to destroy us? Yes, absolutely. Just came right out and said it, didn't they?